Okay, so what we're trying to do today is we're gonna use the letters of our name. My first name is Wright, my middle name is Your, and my last name is Name. Obviously, that's not my name, but I'm just doing that as an example. And then I have chosen the number 10 because that's my sports number or it could be my age. When I'm creating my artwork, I want to think about balance. I wanna think about stretching out the letters. I can use upper or lower case, but I wanna create these cool, interesting shapes just by using the letters of my name and lines. So what I'm gonna do is to do this the correct way, I'm going to start in the middle of my paper, in the middle-ish of my paper, and I'm doing it on a square here. You can do it on a rectangle, it doesn't matter but um, I'm gonna practice first. So this is my W. So notice my W is in the middle. Then I'm gonna turn my paper, okay? So now I have, to, I have to break up these spaces to create some interesting shapes. So I'm gonna go to the next letter, which is R. I can do upper or lower, it does not matter. I'm gonna flip my paper, okay? I'm gonna go to the white part and I'm gonna make an I. Now notice here when I did my I, I made my line move a little bit. I'm not erasing it. I wanna to try to absolutely not erase today, okay? I'm also not going in and making multiple lines. I'm making just a, one line, that's it, okay? So that's my I. My next letter is a T. I can do some upper case and some lower case. I'm gonna flip it around and I have a big space here. So now I'm gonna kinda of go in and make a capital E, okay? If the letter doesn't look like the way that you would write it normally, it's okay, all right? So now I'm gonna go to your, so I'm gonna go to Y. And so I'm always connecting every letter to another letter. It's never like in space. It's always touching another letter. I'm gonna flip it around here because this is a big space here. And I'm gonna create a U. I'm gonna flip it around and I'm gonna make a lowercase r. Okay, now my last name is name. So those are the only letters I have left. So now I wanna make sure they connect, but look at how I can use other lines to create that letter. And I don't have to make an extra line there. Um, I'm gonna flip it around. I'm gonna do a lowercase a. Okay, and I do get a lot of people in here who worry about their letters, but really at the end of the project, you're not going to even be able to tell what it is. So if you erase um, anything on your paper, I typically add those lines back in because it doesn't really matter. Okay, so now I have to add the number 10. So I'm going to come in here and I'm going to add a 10. Okay, so now I'm done, but I've got some really big spaces and I want to kind of balance all that out. I also have lines that are just stop in the middle of nowhere. So I'm gonna extend those lines, but I always wanna stop a line when it gets to another line. If I do it really fast, it's gonna pass the line, and then I'm gonna have to go past that line anyway. So I wanna make sure that when a line touches another line, it stops, because then it's making those lines intentional, and it's making them look like they're not messy and kind of rushed. So same with Sharpie. When I go over my lines with Sharpie, I'm also gonna be very intentional and I'm gonna slowly go over every one of my lines with Sharpie. I thought that shape was kind of big, so I went and added a line in there. Your line, if you break up a space because you think it's big, it does not have to be a straight line, it could be a curved line. But if you add too many lines, say you go in and you add a bunch of lines, every single one of these spaces is gonna end up being a different um, color, and that's okay, but you don't wanna do that way too much, okay? So now, I'm gonna go over all my lines with Sharpie. To me, it helps if I hold my paper down with my non-writing hand and I drag my Sharpie towards me. I feel like I have less control when I drag it away, so I kinda pull it towards me, but that, you may have a different system that works for you.